One play, one play, one play. Add class to your music. How are you? Um, I hope you are fine. I'm in the office, One Play Africa. Yes, and I decided to do a video talking about Ghanaian rap artist Opanka. Opanka is a rapper from Tema. You know Tema, dear. Whenever we mention rap or music and we say Tema, if you know music in Ghana, the way of it, yeah, and some other people like r 2 b have made it sort of the hometown of good rap music and good music. You should feel that any artist that wants to or has the name Tema attached to them, they have some good rhythms following them. But there's a video of Opanka talking about his new EP that's coming out, Elevate EP, that has five songs. And the first track on the EP is called uh, what is it trying times trying times and in the trying times yo opanka bear my pa, he posted a video he was singing the trying times and he was crying but let's just take a bit of the video and then we talk about it praying to the most size the only one who knows that go through a lot past the guy who they sleep for roadside on a low my spirit in the low, always crying, no more lying. My witness be my pillow, mean to me, do. Me need to quap brandy and dandy it in two. Posting pictures like I'm living good. See, obia lo, ubianka, me a breadwinner. So, when you listen to the lyrics carefully from the Chinese times, you could see that, and the emotions that are attached to it, you could see that, bear my embrace. Sorry, sorry to say, oh, come in, I want to borrow Ketcher's word, oh, come in, move. Um, Opanka is having a really hard time and as you all know Opanka has been one of the um, rappers that has held rap down in the space of Tema like you can't mention rappers and leave Opanka like it's not it's not even possible Opanka is G and Opanka daddy Opanka then tells daddy Opanka he has had some very good moments but obviously artists you know Opanka is still not that artist that has still he is not an underground artist he is not a new artist but he is also neither an a-list artist however he is dope opanka is a dope artist like the dear opanka who has had some really song and uh, songs that have done really well in the space of music especially in ghana but um i think that one thing that if you listen to the song very well and then knowing opanka you can see that when it comes to his rap skills, and but I don't know why. And then the Opanka, is, his name is still not out there, played like because yo, if you pick the and you can't leave Opanka out. So to me, as a journalist who follows music, I'm like, why are we not hearing Opanka on probably the same level as say, me how many kusiata. Do you get it? Yeah, but then obviously music is a cycle. Uh, you can't be at the top forever or you can't always be having your shine and all of that. There's a time that you come down a bit and then you go up. But the question is, uh, are artists aware that music is a cycle and it's not all the time that they will have that high moment as they normally do. And you see, the sentiments that he was showing with Musa, that's if it is He's telling a real story. I would say I'm not trepana. Art is not all come, but that cannot be said for only Opanka. There are also uh, artists that it is only so big that they look nice. So in their houses, they are really, really crying because the truth is that Ghana and structures are not helping our musicians. That is the basic fact. Because you must have a hit song to be able to play shows, to be able to get some money. Because online, you know, I hear will you make off online, especially if you don't get like a crazy monster hit. How much can you make offline? So it is these shows that when they get some small hits, yeah, they go and play and then make their small coins and then save for some of the dry days. But here is the moment where you don't have a hit song that will make you play play shows to gather money. Then now our artists begin to struggle. So you could see, say. Even though Opanka, Charlie, the, 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 the video, you let's watch another part where the tears was dropping. It was very emotional. Me need to go brandy and dandy it in two. Posting pictures like I'm living good. See, Obialo, Obianka, me a breadwinner. Yes, so as I was saying, 
music is a cycle now if you have to rely on only his song to survive as an artist obviously no artist can be happy his songs ah, till they die or till they decide to stop their music career so we have to find a way of you know sustaining or making the music the good music that our artists make sustain their lives and probably their ge generations but how do we do that when we have a system that they can't even get their money's worth when they actually have their songs being played on air and all we are still fighting for the locking system and all for, for gamro but the real question is if gamro should fix the locking and then artists should be paid according to the um, um there are many uh, times that their songs are played how many of these artists will even get money like is that money something they can use? even if their songs are played can they use that money for anything substantial so now it comes down back to programming on our radios and on our tvs now as i said we gonna we like only his songs only his songs when i didn't even be so if an artist doesn't have a hair song waboka no matter the investment or the yeah, whether EP, album, or any hit song, Waboka. Uh, so the point is, the program, the program is the TV and the radio people. If they have a program where an artist makes a love song, or they say, oh, but they mean you way, a call me fan say TV PYP. At this point in time, they will play it. So if every month they are playing that song, uh, at least our uh, ratio moon say if the money gathers over the crowd. That's the login system not so work here but but if the login is not working or if it starts working and there's no proper programming be frank with yourself even your earliest artists would they be making money in the next 10 years they won't from that system and for those who have had their shine and the time has passed where do they play their song for them to even get money you it doesn't happen that way and i think another thing that i am i felt another emotion that i felt watching the video was we, we have to check on people like we shouldn't just think that oh our stars because they post nice pictures on social media everything is fine we should check up on people because yo i'm a for phenomenon like people are going through really really hard times and we, we have to support each other and obviously it gets even hard to know if somebody is going through a hard time when they are living their best life on social media or it looks like they are living their best life on social media posting videos you know posting pictures you know artists show business they have to portray a certain standard but standard now will be there how do people come to you to come and help you so this thing it was a pure show of emotion and i loved it i'm hoping that um when the ep drops people will patronize it it will be dope but was it also an emotional manipulation to get people to go in to be anticipating for the ep or something and i uh, really really he's going through trying times because there are so many songs on the ep five songs i'm thinking obey 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 which will be a freestyle opanka is known for rapping I mean, dope rapping, we will like it. Even though he rapped in this one, the tears and all, others are saying that emotional manipulation to get us to listen to the EP. But yo, Opanka is a dope rapper. For me, whether emotional manipulation, psychological manipulation, when the EP is out, elevate EP, go and stream it. Friday is dropping, go and stream it. Charlie, I'm out of here. Subscribe to the channel, press the bell icon, and bow. One play, one play, one play, at class to your music.